All right, folks, so heading into a Target over here. Uh, yeah, out and about, want to get out. We got to do some grocery shopping and stuff. So yeah, we, we came a ways because the storm was pretty bad, but yeah, let's check out and see what they got. I'm over here at this section. All right, so you can see your typical things. Not really much. Um, still got some of those. I'm surprised that they're doing so well, the uh, Hocus Pocus. People are buying them. I do like that Ash. I don't think I own him yet. Own all the rest of them. You still got that Michael Myers right there. But look at this. Yep. They got some new things. They got a lot of them too. Look at this. Wow. I'm not a fan of the black and white ones, but the Vincent Price one, yeah, I don't know. And then they got these, some Super 7. <laughs> Way too funny. Yeah, you guys should already know what that's from, right? Original hip-hop people right there. Need I say more? Yeah, that's from back in my day right there. And so you have a few things, not really much. But yeah, they got some new stuff. New things that are hitting. Look at that. All right, folks, so yeah, this is where we're headed. Is this Transformers? All right, so we are here at the Transformer area. Yes, they are doing good. Transformers in the house. We got a lot of new things. I do really like these. We got some more down there. We got some of those, the Aikido Fighters. We still got that gold label Aquaman. I do like that, but I don't know about this. DC Multiverse. They always seem to have really weird angles, if you know what I mean. So it's a little hard to review them. We got some of these. Looks like they have all three. Yeah. Somebody decided to go through them. And I guess this is the OCD in me that tends to put them back, but it looks like they have all three. We got some of those from Marvel Legends. Is it the same one? Yeah, same. And then you have a lot of him. I know people are still looking for him. Alright, so I found some more Marvel Legends. A whole lot of those. You can see that. Yeah. Yeah, it's all. And then one She Hulk, which is surprising. Not too much going on for Dragon Ball Z. Same character. They have all the same character of that. And then you have a few of the Gundams. Then you got a Dragon Ball Z. Another Dragon Ball Z, same one. Then you got these same Gundams. As for Pokemon, yeah, they got a little bit of Pokemon right here. Move this aside, you can see this. Got a shiny. Some of you Pokemon players that know, oh, it's not a shiny, oh, that sucks. Ah, oh, shiny. <laughs> All right, there you go for Pokemon. Typical for Jurassic World. Yeah. It's still a little wiped out. Is this that new one? Yeah, I think that might be that newer one. Right there. You got some of that. Something going on there. That guy is awesome. He's pretty cool. Okay, and then for Masters, yeah, it's all Stratos. I, and I over here, I looked on their clearance aisle, and they had like uh, Beastman and all of them in the clearance aisle, but I checked them. Still same price, so why aren't they over here with these guys? They never lowered the price on them. And then you come right around over here, and it's about to get funky like a monkey, folk. Here it goes. Boom. Funky like a monkey. Here it is. Man, I've been looking for this guy right here. First time seeing him in the wild. I might have to. I just might have to. So I found an ultimate warrior just sitting here amongst the dingo warrior. 
they say Ultimate Warrior, but that's Dingo Warrior, man. Come on, get real. That's the Dingo Warrior. It's some old World Class Championship Wrestling. For all you wrestling enthusiasts over there, you should know that already. Got a Britt Baker. All right, so we got some Lego Friends. I like these, I think they're pretty cool. And we got the little classic ones. These are always good, especially when you got young children in the house. That classic set always just works. You got another princess thing right there. Ooh, another one classic. You got that. <coughs> you got some bigger sets. Really cool doing it for my Lego people out there who want to see some Legos. For sure about it. You got the space shuttle launch. Very nice. And then that's about what they got for the Friends version of Lego. Got some really cool Lego sets on the end caps. Look at that. That one looks cool. I like that. Oh, that is super sweet. Venom. This is nice. I like it. And you got that. Alright, so it's Star Wars time, folks. And... Yeah, you got some good stuff out there. They are restocking. These aisles were jet empty. And now they're doing some huge restocks. So it's nice to see this back on the shelves. So you got some of these. And then you got these. Yeah. Real nice. Like seeing the restocks. I'm loving it all the way around. And then they got some Harry Potter up there, some Jurassic World, Super Mario, you see all that, ooh this is a new set, I haven't seen this one, look at that, it's cool, more Super Mario going down, the aisles are getting full so I gotta get out of here folks, then they have some of these, and Thor's Hammer, still available, and that. Alright, so for Mario, they got some stuff. They got some good sets. Let's turn this around. You can see this set. This one. This one. Really nice. And then you go up here. You got the same one. You got this set. Good things for Mario. Hitting. And then Hot Wheels is a big fat goose egg. Nothing here. Alright, so Monster High is a thing now. And it really got elevated the moment that they announced that Elvira came to Monster High. Um, yeah, we went on Mattel's thing and they were sold out on the Elvira like fast. Like didn't even give us a chance. So hopefully I can get an Elvira figure that is like this one. But it was a really nice box set. I think it was like 65. Uh, but yeah, they're doing things like that. Monster High, folks. All right, folks, so that's it for my uh, my hunt today. One store, uh, that was all I needed. Um, super packed. It's Martin Luther King Day. Um, so everybody is out and about um, from, yeah, people bumping into you and hitting you with cards and everything else. But the reason that we actually went out today, I have some of my family with me, was because we are on the hunt not just for toys, okay? You guys are going to laugh. Here in California, we are having a problem with eggs. Eggs are very expensive. And the ones that have them the cheapest are Costco's. But throughout the Bay Area and throughout the Valley and the San Francisco Bay, eggs are very expensive. Like, really expensive. Like, for five dozen, like $30. So, Costco tends to have them cheaper. So, we went from Costco to Costco. We found a Costco that had them at a really good price. So, yeah, worth the trip. Got a toy hunt in. It was all good. But you're wondering what my score was. Did I score my predators that I'm looking for? No, not again, not today. And it's just kind of, it's a little frustrating, but I know I'm going to get them just like what I found today. Here's my score today. I scored a six inch uh, Boba Fett on card. Uh, card's really good condition. So, um, yeah, I'm sure it's probably the same figure that we've all been getting for the last few years. But it's on card. All right, so that's what Star Wars collectors do. <laughs> Man. Anyway, $34 later, 
I now have the same exact figure that I have in box. So, like, share, subscribe, comment, and hey, from most harmed yours, everyone, good night.